Welcome to my vlog. So I just finished filming a YouTube video where I did this massive Amazon haul. I'm thinking it's gonna be up on my channel before I get this vlog up because I'm gonna try to vlog throughout the week. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up. Y'all, it's a mess. I'm a very messy filmer and I don't know what to do about that. You know, I like to clean. So one thing about me is I really do like to clean. It's like therapy to me. So like things like this, I don't mind. Come clean with me. inside of them like caramels and marshmallows this these are sticks but you're only supposed to put milk in there and just swirl oh them. that's actually They're so nice. oh all right all right so hear me out i'm gonna get kind of crazy guys oh my god I'm yeah gonna put, like, that's a probably couple. good all right mm -hmm. and then we're gonna what is this mint chocolate maybe like one of these oh yeah and a couple of these <laughs> Oh, 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 and, um, caramel. caramel. That's delicious. Whoa, look at this. Isn't this beautiful? That is a hot Coke. Look at all your little treats at the bottom. That's probably gonna taste crazy. Eh? Uh, literally, they don't mess with me. Uh -huh. And I have, like, okay, it doesn't actually suck. Oh, <laughs> dollar in the background. Babe, see if that needs to go in the fridge. It says it's delicious. Not wow. It's delicious. Look at your little, come over here and show your body suit we got you for your birthday at Revolve. It's so cute. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> to you. Blow them out, baby.
Bye. 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 <laughs> Maybe that's what you will like, Aaron. <laughs> you like that, sweetie? It's pretty good. pretty good. I don't want any cake anymore. I'm just kidding. I don't want this last. <laughs> yeah. That's your piece. Mmm. -hmm. That's so good. Adopt a family time. It is. We just woke up. It's Target time. We decided to go to Target in the morning because it's going to be crowded. I have a rash on my face. Okay, let's not get into it. I have a dermatologist appointment this week, but anyways, adopt a family. We're at Target to get our adopt a family gifts and items. We have two families. One because one of our families is a gift card family only. We reached out and talked to her and she said that she does not have a permanent home right now that she's bouncing around. We also offered to get her a place to stay for the holidays and she said that her sister already did, but that she couldn't carry a lot of clothing and toys around. But she's about to get settled somewhere. So she said if we could just get her gift cards that she could get what she needs um, whenever she can carry it around. So we already got her all her gift cards. So that's one family done. It was just a unique, different situation for her this year. So we got her a bunch of gift cards. And then our second family, how many kids? Um, two, but really four. Two kids, but four kids. Yeah. Okay. Two kids on the list, but... He said that he had an extra two kids. Okay, so we'll get extra toys. And then we want to throw a couple items in for Toys for Tots. So we got a lot of stuff to get today at Target. So let's do this. I just woke up too, I just told you that. <sighs> Ugh, look at this hair, honey. I was out last night till almost 12 o'clock in the morning celebrating Daniel's birthday. Stop recording me! Stick your hand, Laura. I got them. Oh. Okay, that's bomb. Oh. Ooh. The caramel is blue. <laughs> Did they like the caramel? What? Did they like the caramel? Yeah. Did you make a wish? Why? Well, yeah. Oh, I'm so tired. But I was like, we need to get this done today. We can just make sure everybody gets everything before Christmas. So I was like, let's get up early and go to Target before it gets really busy here. Cause I don't know about your targets, but the week before Christmas, Target's in Los Angeles, a baby. I ain't trying to get caught up in the crowd. So let's do it. Let's do it. Barla, no, you're not salsa. Girl takes one salsa class and this is her now. <laughs> you're killing it actually. Okay, let's check the footwork. <laughs> okay, was that salsa? In the slippers. <laughs> Right now I'm sweating. The six-year-old likes cars, so I kind of want to get him a Ferrari. I'm between a Porsche and a Ferrari, but I think a six-year-old would drive a Ferrari instead of a Porsche. For sure. Hot Wheels. You want to get him some cars to go with it, like a little pack? Yeah, a good pack. What the hell is that, a helicopter car? I don't know. He likes basketball, it says in the information pack, so. He likes Legos. Our little girl likes baby dolls, so we're definitely about to get her one. She's only four, so I was gonna get the three plus. I'm thinking her, so cute. I picked up another toy for the boys. Okay. I love stuff like Tyler this. always buys stuff for kids that he loves. <laughs> Arts and crafts. We're gonna get some clothes for them. Get a little sweat set. I'm gonna get him another little outfit. I picked this out for the little girl. So cute. All me all day. He likes sports. I also got him this belt. Those are cool. I'm just gonna get him some little socksies. We'll get him some shoes too. Socks? 
check. Is that 12? I always like to get them socks and undies and belts and like shoes so they can wear to school. You think it's the right size? She wears a 20. I got the wrong size socks. We'll get those. I I, I don't know how, look, look what size I got, little boy. I don't even know how to read Jeez, sock boy. sizes. Okay, now we corrected it. Did it, what? I'm gonna get the little girl this sweats jogger set. Trying to match a little butterfly t shirt with some, some leggings. leggings. There you go. I like that. Yeah. All right. Let's do this one. Okay. That's cute. And she can wear that also with her little jean leggings. We're also shopping for the dad. Perfect. I agree. We both think black is a safer choice. People like to wear darker colors more. I think basic tees are always good too. We were thinking this, should we get like it's a, a little, I don't know, that gray or like a plain color? We're good, it'll go with the black. Uh, Sweatshirt yeah. We got. All right guys, we're going to the second level. Hopefully our cart doesn't explode on the way uh, down. <laughs> All right, we got some shoes for the kids. They need a heater, so we want to get them a little space heater. I also got, the, space heater the dad asked me. for bedding, so I got this soft bedding for his bed. I got it in charcoal since it's for a man. Maybe he would want this color. Space what heater. We need another card. All right, now we need the card. All right, I want to get the little girl this coloring book with the markers and crayon. I like it. I like it. Cute. All right, guys, we are boxing everything up. We're going to ship everything so yeah. they get it before Christmas just because that's how it's going to be easier for this family. So we're shipping the individual so we're doing uh, the little girl the little boy and the dads so will do three big boxes go into their home all right guys we got it packed aaron's gonna take it to the post office today but we have all the little girl stuff we have to finish jenga in this in the box with the dad stuff but we have everything in here we, we packed this book bag we got on filled with clothing and the little boy's box so full with toys and clothes and everything for christmas We got some rotten, nasty bananas. Today we're gonna make some banana bread. With our rotten bananas. Ah. We're gonna leave this banana out. She might be too far gone. Okay. Those look like mashed potatoes. One and a half cups of all-purpose flour. Yeah. Okay. One teaspoon of baking soda. Salt. Some salt. I feel like that was heavy on salt. One but, cup of but, hat. Like literally like punch. Make a complete mess. I don't even play around. Now we're using three fourths of butter. Ooh, oh. And then we're gonna stir it for just a couple minutes. Yay! Yeah. We're adding the two eggs. One teaspoon. We're just gonna slowly like at a time mix those in. This is the best part. Adding in these little chocolate chips. Oh, it makes it so good. Oh, <gasps> we're gonna prep it with some avocado oil. Spray it like so. The mixture looks like extra whipped up today. Yeah, it does. Ooh, we're gonna put that in for like for 35 minutes and probably take it out around 45. Girl's <laughs> just eating the batter. Take this. Girl, I'm gonna put this in the oven. I have to hurry. You set a timer for 35 minutes. 35. Oh, that's done. Oh. Aaron added pecans on top. Pecans or pecans? I say pecan. This is so pretty. Ooh. Yeah, so moist. Bigger. Oh my god, Aaron, it looks perfect. It's Yummy. Mmm. It's so good. It's so fluffy. I would only add a bit more banana. Uh. Hello everybody, it is the week before Christmas and today is actually very eventful. So one, I needed to edit 
a video, which I finished. Two, I've got to wrap a bunch of gifts. I've also got to get some gifts ready to ship out. Our new couch is coming. The problem with the new couch, yes, it's the cloud couch, but the problem is we don't think it's gonna fit in our living room, and if it doesn't, we literally have to return it and send it back with the delivery people, because they told us to do that if it doesn't work for us. So this is gonna be interesting. And then three, I have a nail appointment, and then what, what number am I on now? I don't even know anymore, but then Manny's supposed to come over, and we're supposed to do our gift exchange tonight, so I also gotta get his gift ready. I don't know how so much stuff builds up on one day. I'm in my office right now, it's green. Okay, we're gonna get into that later. I wanna try to get these gifts ready real quick while I have some time this morning. Also, this shirt is like choking me. It like keeps getting tight around my neck and I'm about to freak out. I've been on my computer all morning working, so we're about to get this day going and get these gifts ready to go. Here. I love it, but as a Virgo, I found a problem that I don't love. But you guys on Instagram are giving me suggestions, so let me show you. Stay away, baby. Okay, here is the new couch. What do we think? Honest opinions on it. Yeah, yeah, please don't be honest. I'm trying to love it. Please convince me to love it because it was really expensive. Babe, you're not supposed to sit on it. I'm showing them the couch. I'm showing them how it works. <laughs> I'll give you an example of what it does. So this irks me, and they warned me at the store. They said this is from Restoration. They said that um, they said that basically you have to constantly floof this couch every time you touch it. So they're like, basically, if you don't want a high maintenance couch, you don't get it. But I'm high maintenance, so I wanted a high maintenance couch. That's not what's irking me, because y'all know I'm gonna floof this 82 times a day. What's really irking me is that the couch is shorter on this end. But yeah, and there's more space back Look here. Over here, like, do I put a table back here? Long like, what do I do? Because we're not gonna ever walk back here. It's kind of nice because we could actually use these doors now because the other couch came all the way back here so you couldn't really get back there. The only thing I see where Laura's coming from but this couch is just so pretty and 
comfy that's like I want it to work so bad. I know. I want it to work so bad. I also want to get a new coffee table. Anyways, it doesn't come out far enough. So my other couch was custom. Y'all remember when I was whining and complaining about how uncomfortable it was? So it was custom. So I had it fitted perfectly in here and that's why it fits so great. And then this one comes a bit short. We measured, see if we could fit in another centerpiece, but it would be way too long. It would push us like to the door and outside the fridge. So I just want it to come to like right here. A lot of you are suggesting I do a table with a little lamp. Prada also told me to do a table with a lamp. I think that would be good. So, but I put the blanket basket right there for now. It used to sit over here, but since this one comes out far, it kind of makes sense to put it over here. I don't know, I'm figuring it out. I've got to get used to it. I'm really, really anal about my home, especially the room we spend most of the time in. So it's I got to so figure it out. Cozy, yeah, that's the only thing. Okay, the practicality level of the couch is the reason, real reason we switched up. Oh, you just like sink into it. The Our other couch was really short. So like the it would probably come to right about there. So yeah, it was it pretty tight to lay on and like to, you had to pretty much sit up on it. Yeah, and it there was no leg it space. It wasn't that soft either. This one's like, yeah, it's like a pillow. That's why they call it the cloud couch. It's like you're on a cloud, so we wanted a comfortable couch because we spend all of our time here. We entertain in here. Every time our friends come over, they plop right down on our couch. It's like, you know, we want... This is so cozy. Yeah, and the, another good thing is you can unzip this and that and throw it in the washer. How long before boo boo pees on it? Dude, I don't know. Don't you guys think an earthy coffee table would also look good? Y'all, I got this off TikTok shop and only one of my cats love it, so... I still say it's a win. I'm wrapping Manny's gifts and I got him and my assistant the fuse bead because what everybody likes to do is be like, oh my God, what are those? They're the most fun activity ever. That's what they are. So I got them fuse beads. Manny loves fuse beads. My assistant was like, I need to do that. So I got her some too, but I'm trying to wrap it. I got this thing of yarn for really cheap at like home goods. It's like, you just pull it. You have like an endless amount of cute string for presents. So I was gonna do some going this way too. I'm getting funky this year, okay? Okay, now we're really in business. We have Housewives of Salt Lake and we're wrapping gifts. I don't really know a better way to wrap presents. <laughs> okay, I finished Manny's gift. This is what it looks like. I think he's gonna love it. It's the Lululemon Duffel and this is the fuse beads. And then in it, it has the water bottle, aloe pant, homemade brownie. That's gonna be his favorite part, Lululemon case to put his toiletries in. I just think it's perfect. I'm back from getting my toes done and I'm still wrapping gifts. So it's been hours. I'm wrapping Tyler's shoes, I got him. Um, I'm still on my Housewives of Salt Lake kick. I'm wrapping Tyler's gifts because he's gonna help me with errands. I have those pajama pants I got from Amazon. It is storming so crazy. It's so cold outside. That's why I'm wearing this Ugg jacket. So we're gonna make this a real vibe because I'm about to turn the fireplace on in here. Continued our scheduled programming.